Naughty Gang, Naughty Gang, Naughty Gang. Welcome back to the channel. In today's Madden 22 video, we about to go over how I've been making coins every time I get a low stack between 80 and 150,000 coins. If you're new to the channel, drop a thumbs up on the video, hit that red subscribe button, turn your notifications on, all that good stuff which is free. Make sure that you have your notifications on. You might have to turn them off, turn them back on so you can get all tips released on this channel. Let's get into some shout out. We got a shout out from You Win You Wish. We got a shout out for Curtis Brown and a shout out for Blaze on Xbox. If you want a chance to be shouted out in the video, all you got to do is be active. Make sure that you drop a thumbs up, show your love and appreciation and say Naughty Game. Let's get in the breakdown. This is your one-stop shop for all Madden needs. Whether you're looking for some fly merchandise, you're looking for eBooks, you're looking for a Patreon membership, or you just wanna become part of the Tutty Squad. I appreciate all the love and support. Everything is in the link in the description. Let's get it. Now the first method that I was doing yesterday was sniping 96 overalls, and I was trying to find them under 198k so 198k and lower is the range that i was looking for so as you can see 202,000 right there and if you filter through every once in a while you will see one that's under 198k okay sometimes you can find one for about 194k and then what i would do with that is I would quick sell it for training. That's gonna give you about 36 to 37,000 training. Okay, you're gonna take that 36 to 37,000 training, and then you're gonna come over here to the training packs. Once you come over to the training packs, you have to figure out for that day what is the most valuable between the 92 plus overall rising stars or the heavyweight players, okay? Both of these are gonna give you two pecs, and then with the remaining training, you're gonna take that over here to the offensive playbooks. Now, the best playbooks that I've been using with the extra training, you're usually gonna have between 3,000 and 3,400 training. That's gonna give you a lot of pecs, about 20 to 22 pecs. Now, the pec that I've been selling off goes between 3,600 and 4,200 every single time. So that's gonna give you an extra 60 to 80,000 coins, okay? So you would take the 92 overall pluses. I pull a 94 and then a 92 overall. So that gives me about 130,000 for the 94. I spent 198,000 and then about another 48 to 50,000 for the 92. So we're gonna come down here to my recents. So the cards that I sold off recently using the first method, you're gonna see right here, I have a 94, a Mana St. Brown, and then I have this 92 Oway, okay? So right here, 130, 180, 190,000 coins, okay? So that means that I spent 198,000 coins, and from these two pools, I got 190,000 coins back. So that leaves me about 8,000 coins under. So then I turn around and I got 3,000 right here for this playbook, 3,500 right here. So that's about break even. And then I have profit three, profit six, profit nine, profit 12. So that's about 12 to 15,000 coin profit. Very, very easy. Snipe you a 96 overall for as cheap as possible. The cheaper or the better the snipe, the more you have a chance to make even more profit. And I didn't use all my training. I still have out of these playbooks, I have one, two, three, four, I have five, six playbooks. I still have about 13 more playbooks to put up and sell if I wanted to. So if this right here already gives me 12,000 profit and I was to get 13 more playbooks, 13 times 2,500 or 3,000, 12, 24, 36, that would put me at about a 38 to 50 
thousand coin profit okay not losing anything but like i said the better the snipe the better the chance of closing the gap on these two and then you can use less of these to make profit so if i was to go get the rest of my playbooks right now i would be sitting at a big profit over thirty-five thousand, up to about fifty thousand profit didn't really do the math now the second coin making tip i've been using is the team of the year sets and remember every time that a video is released somebody goes in and messes up the method okay so people with your notifications on can get these super super fast justin jefferson and two more team of the year players last night was going for about 284 to 286 thousand coins now with these pieces i was able to flip some of the pieces that i sniped and i was able to also only spend 230 thousand coins to make my justin jefferson so you're going to want to get 193 overall i have a full breakdown of the prices okay so with the breakdown of the prices for the team of the year set you want to get 193 overall for at least 68k or lower then you're going to need 291 overalls for 40k or lower you need two of them so as you can see my 91s i got one for 36,000. that puts me about 4,000 under okay so this one right here i was able to buy and then i can turn around and resell him for 42,000, lose 4,000 off tax and make about a 2500 profit and then i got these two right here that i can put up just for the set so 39,000, 39,000 under 40,000. we are doing good then you have the 89,000s you want to get for about 18K. So 89,000, 18, this one 17, 6. This one right here is an easy, easy flip. And then this 89 was another easy flip. So 15,000, you usually want to spend about 18,000. So I can repost this one for about 19K. I'm going to lose 1,900 off. This is going to be another 2,000 coin profit. Then with your 87 overalls, you have to get four of them. So you want to spend between 9K at the max, okay? So right here, because I had other snipes, I just got them for 10,000. The 87s is the hardest ones to get. So all total, with my total prices of the resales in the snipe, I spent 233,000 coins. So all total, you need 193, 68K coins or less, 291s. 40k coins or less 389s 18k coins or less and then 487s 9k coins or less okay so that puts you between 233 to 238k now when i turn around and i resold my jefferson that i did his price started going way down within like 20 25 minutes of me completing the set so he was at 280,000 which would have gave me with this car and the power up about a 34 35,000 coin profit so right here instead I made this car I had to hurry up and drop them down take them down about two or three different times sold them for 256 so once he sold off with the Texas I broke even for about 232, 233,000. And then I have this right here with about a 12,000 coin profit. Now, it is two more other team of the year cards that are going for way more. So do your research, do a little bit of time. Some of the team of the year cards are still going for 275, 277, 280. So that will give you about a 28 to 30,000 coin profit but you got to make sure that his price does not drop off like this Justin Jefferson did but if you went to like the cornerback section you could still find the Patrick Sertain the cheapest one with the same amount of pieces that you need is at 266,000 still so that gives you another eight to nine thousand over what I got so instead of 11,000 profit that would be closer to about 17,000 profit and then you just got to filter between different positions go make yourself some coins profit.